This is a big crystal of kyanite, and what you can see is that there's some little thin lines that are parallel to the elongation of the crystal. Those are the cleavages, and then there are these short, thick cross hatches. Um, that's parting. It's not actually cleavage, even though it kind of looks like that. That's really characteristic of kyanite, though. Thin cleavages and, and this cross hatching, the parting. Really typical to see these low interference colors. This is kyanite in an eclogite. Uh, and again, you can see the long, uh, thin cleavages and the short uh, cross hatching, the, the parting. Has very high relief. This is a whole cluster of kyanite crystals. There are some that are elongate and they have the thin cleavages parallel to the elongation. And then there are others that are a little chunkier and they look all broken up. That's because it's really hard to polish that orientation of kyanite. And so it actually does get kind of broken up where that parting is so strong. Again, you can see really low interference colors. The maximum here is orange. This is a rare kyanite from Tanzania. It's very faintly pleochroic yellow. That's, that's not your imagination. If you see that, it has cleavages parallel to the elongation of the crystal. doesn't really have strong parting. Um, and low interference colors here. The vivid blue mineral on the outside is uh, called yoderite, another rare mineral. This is what kyanite looks like when it's deformed. Again, you can see the cleavages running along the elongation of the crystal. When I cross the polars, you're going to see that the whole crystal doesn't go extinct all at once. It has this kind of sweeping or undulatory extinction. That's because the crystal is bent, uh, so, little, so parts of it go extinct at a slightly different angle than uh, other parts. This is one of the few samples I have with kyanite and sillimanite actually in contact with each other. Kyanite is the high relief mineral with good cleavage. Sillimanite is all the fuzzy stuff that's now coming to the bottom of the field of view. Across the polars and you can see the kyanite has that yellow orange interference colors and sillimanite is similar um, but it has a very different texture and that's how you can tell the difference between the two uh, in this context.